Faith affects everything in our lives. Not just prayer, not just worship. It affects the decisions you make. It affects the path that you take. It affects the conversations that you have. It is a force that's working on the inside of us. The Apostle Paul tells us that of the three things, the three necessities of the spiritual life, faith is one of them. And it is absolutely necessary for us to get a deeper and broader view of faith so that we can live a life that pleases God, not just on Sunday, but on Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, and Saturday as well. Faith is central. Faith has to be at the very center and the very core of your heart. The Bible teaches us that out of the abundance of the heart, the mouth speaks. And the Bible teaches us that we have to guard and protect the deposit that God has made within that heart. One of those deposits is our faith. The Apostle Peter tells us that that faith is precious. We have to guard it, we have to allow it to grow, and we have to use it in this life for the glory and for uh, for the glory of God and for the advancement of his kingdom. So come with us to be better prepared to be able to walk out your faith in, in these times. Four times the Bible tells us the just shall live by faith. God doesn't doesn't uh, use excess words. When he repeats something specifically like that, it's saying, listen, pay attention, faith. This is how you live in relationship to me, and this is how you will work out and walk out your lives here in this earth. It is central because it is the main thing that that will please me in your life because it demonstrates your trust in me. Praise God.